Where did Kisara run off to? You don't think she took off after Kelzalik, do you? No. Nagal entrusted her with his dream. She wouldn't do something reckless like that. Right now, I think she just needs time to think. What she does from here on out is up to her. She has to be the one to decide. Hmm. <laughs> You all arrived here from Cislodia, yes? In that case, you should depart via the South Gate, rather than the one you arrived through. After all that, Kisara never came back to see us. I'm surprised she slipped away without us noticing. Where would she even go? I hope this place survives. You think the Danons and Renans have a chance of getting along? We didn't really do much to change things around here, did we? This realm had its own walls to overcome. And in the end, it was the people themselves who decided to break them down, without any help from us. I hope they keep going. I really do. Yeah, well, if you say so, I guess. Huh? All right. I leave command of the Gold Dust Cats in your hands. You've got nothing to worry about, Kisara. I'll do your brother proud. Wow. Looks like it's time to go. Take good care of Zare for me. All right, Lagil? You've got it. Stay safe, Kisara. Did you come to say goodbye? Actually, I was wondering if you could use another companion. Huh? Well, we certainly don't mind you coming along. We just figured you'd stay behind and help rebuild. These people could use you. I thought much the same thing. However, in the end, something changed my mind. Ever since Miguel died, I've been thinking a lot. About where I went wrong, what I should have done differently. You know, that sort of thing. It's true that our dream of coexistence saved many Danon lives, 
but we were naive and short-sighted. I was so wrapped up in my idea of how things should be that I didn't see the problems that existed right in front of us. I thought we had been given a utopia, and so I never bothered to look too far past its surface. I chose to be ignorant, and because of that, because of me, my brother. Megal's death wasn't your fault, Kisara. Perhaps you're right, but in the end, it was me he entrusted this dream to. I learned that nothing in this life is free, or gained without sacrifice. Now that I know that, I'll just have to figure out what else I don't know. So, decided to join us? I have. And hopefully I can continue to protect Elda Menencia from outside the dream world, for the sake of those still inside. And here I thought you joined for an opportunity on my life. In all honesty, I'm grateful to you. I truly am. I don't blame you for what happened. But I must also leave your service. No longer will I be defined by protecting a Renan Lord. From now on, when I fight, I fight to protect my dream. All I ask is that you do your part, that you fight alongside me, not just for those who used to believe in your dream, but for those that still do, Dohalim. I understand. I'm no longer a lord anyway. Well, this crew just gets bigger and bigger. All right, where to, team? We make for Mahagsar, the Valley of the Four Winds. something. Mahogsar. That makes four out of the five realms that I've visited now. I wonder what kind of lord we're gonna find there. It doesn't matter. They try to get in our way. We'll take them down and that'll be bad. <sighs> I didn't realize there was a pond here. Yeah, this is Taka Pond, and it happened to have saved my life once upon a time. What do you mean? As a kid, 
I survived life under the past lords by escaping here when I needed to. It's terrible to swim in, but great for catching a bite for dinner away from Ren and Eyes. Bear in mind, our rations back then weren't enough to live off of. You had to take matters into your own hands if you wanted enough food to survive. But how did you catch them? With your bare hands? That might take a while. Fish are prone to swim away at the first sign of trouble. I'd put bait or a lure on a line and use it with a fishing rod. You must not be familiar with fishing if this sounds new to you. Here, let me show you how it's done. There's a nice breeze here. Yeah. I've got a good feeling about this one. fish is way bigger than I was expecting. You tamed a real beast. And that's all there is to it. Wow. It seems like you need to have good reflexes to catch anything. Kisara? Oh, oh sorry. Looks like we're going to... Be that's how fishing goes. Megal told me that different fish live in different regions, but that doesn't change... Of course. Each fish... When you put it like that... You're just in it for the food. I was hoping we'd get to fish during our travels. So, if you have... Good to hear. Okay! I'm always... He's amazed what healing arts can... <sighs> hey. Hmm? Is it just me? Or have those two barely spoken a single word to one another? I know, right? But after everything that happened with Megal, is it really any wonder? Kind of puts a damper on the whole journey, though, huh? How long do you think they're going to keep this up? If it bothers you that much, why don't you ask them? Why do I have to ask? How come you walk together like that? <gasps> she really doesn't beat around the bush. You mean Kisara and myself? You hadn't noticed? You've been practically joined at the hip ever since we left Vicent. I guess it's force of habit, most likely. I was always ready to protect him, should the need arise. It sort of came with the job description. Right. From being in the Elder Menencia Guard. Although, Dohalim's pretty capable of defending himself, isn't he? Having guards doesn't necessarily mean the one being guarded is weak. No one's perfect all the time. Even so, it's not like they're entirely wrong, Gisara. You're no longer in my employ, after all. 
I don't know. I mean, if it's what she's used to and you're both comfortable with it, then who are we to judge? But she doesn't serve him anymore. It isn't normal for her to keep following him around like she still does. You know, she's probably right. And a lot has changed over the last few days. Perhaps I'll give it some thought after all. Does that sound all right by you? Of course. You might want to stop asking his permission for every little thing while you're at it. <laughs> Sorry. It's not that easy, shaking off old habits. Why are you looking at me like that? That armor you wear is standard issue. Hell yeah! There's no way you- Mind if I join you, Law? Oh, hey, Alfin. What's up? Nothing. I was just surprised to see you weren't training for once. Got a stomach ache or something? Uh, you know I don't literally train around the clock, right? I do take breaks. Do you? It seems like you're training every chance you get. Well, yeah. It can't be helped if I want to get stronger. Zephyr said that? When I was a little kid, yeah. I always followed him wherever he went and tried to learn as much from him as I could. He said, it's good to be passionate, but don't overdo it. Just like there are times when you want to take a break from studying, sometimes your body wants to take a break from training, too. I was always rushing around and forgetting to rest, so he ended up telling me that a lot. <laughs> that definitely sounds like him. It's nothing to get sad over. Still, I can't help but wonder if that was my dad's way of teaching me the dangers of rushing into things too quickly. Then again, maybe I'm just overthinking things. I wish I'd had more time to talk to him about this kind of stuff. <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. I feel pretty refreshed after that. Sleep. I always love this sound of hammers banging away. Finally. If only we could have flown with the wind to get here faster. Courteous, aren't you? Anything in armor is all mine! You're finished! Can you take it? Hope this works! Tempest. 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 It's a duel of the art! Come on, come on! We natural energy! That's the airborne scoundrel! Sounds like a job oh, for your patrol! Thanks, Kisara! Let's do it! Kisara, frozen! Hammer! Hammer. Make you be a big old thief! Looks like it could be worth something. I thought you were going to wreck them. I'm not nearly finished yet, and I'll provide assistance however I can. These little ones are hardly worth our time. Got fires. Less talking, more pummeling. Cut the meat to enemy's hearts. 
No complaints here! Everyone hanging in there? Retreat if you know what's good for you. Fight it. It's over. Dance in the wind. Not in your dreams. Begin. Be yeah. still. Right here. Right 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 I'm ready. You gotta jump for cover, okay? Dance in the wind. Be still. Find freaks. What you think you're doing? Still. See him. Can you take care of them? No sooner said than done. The enemy wields arms too. You'll soon see about that. Glacial spears. I'm ready. A victory for the ages. Is that the Zoogle we... Coming through! Take it down! In here! Begin! Ready to go! Elusive Deity! Infernal Torrent! I'll save you! 
Stronger. Looks like we made it here in one piece. How's this? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey. Believe this.
Yeah! Whoa! Is that... Oh, this is bad. Real bad. That's great. Yes! <laughs> man, that was amazing! No wonder the old man was so gung-ho about it. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? Shion? You've got sauce on your face. <laughs> Guess I'll polish up my sword. I'll see you again tomorrow. I think we've rested long enough. Let's keep moving. Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. Some interesting moves there, Dohalim. I'm glad you're on our side. I'm simply glad to hear that I can make myself useful to you all. Huh? What's wrong? We seem to have come across some rather unusual objects. What? You mean that pile of garbage? No mere garbage, I assure you. Still, I've never seen anything shaped like it before. I'm intrigued. Uh, uh... Are you curious about this stuff, Rinwell? Uh, oh, uh, yeah, I think he might have found some old Danon relics. They look like the remains of a bunch of objects that disappeared after the Renans first invaded. 
And yet here I am, holding them without so much as a second thought. I imagine this sight must be unsettling to you. Not really. Just that it must be nice to be a Renin who has time to indulge in stuff like that. Unlike the rest of us. Are you interested in this stuff too, Dohalim? Charmed may be a better turn of phrase. I simply love objects that can give me a sense of what their maker was thinking. The history that went into their creation. You see, we Renans have hardly any such objects that trace back to our distant past. I still don't understand what you two find so intriguing about it, though. Why not? We're talking about our own culture here. I get that, but it's not like this stuff is any use now, does it? It's just old. Real old. Oh, but it does. Holding it in your hands like this, one can feel and engage with the distant past in a way no history book can ever accomplish. I'll take your word for it. Well, seeing as it's Dan in history, just make sure you're careful with it. All right, Dohalim? But of course. sense a strange power from this. Visibility along this path will remain limited for some time. Take care not to get ambushed. I'm surprised you know the terrain here so well. Lords don't strike me as having much time for wandering in the woods. Sometimes I would take strolls along here when I wished to be alone. You always did have a bad habit of disappearing without telling any of us guardsmen. 